Hey YouTube, here I was just chilling like McGillan, relaxing in my lazy boy recliner, flipping through YouTube videos and gumming down my gummy bears when I noted a message through Instagram. Rix, how do you get those long points on 9XXB pencils? Well, I'll tell you the story right after this short intro. Okay, well, my reply was, I don't remember. I don't remember where I sharpened this pencil. I have more than one 9XXB on my drawing desk, and I have not yet had to resharpen any of them. So I don't recall how I got this point, but this is the point that I am pretty sure uh, this viewer was referring to. My answer to him was, hey, check out my pencil sharpener playlist and uh, find out which one of those pencil sharpeners was the one that I uh, demonstrated on a 9XXB because honestly, I don't remember. And I would have to go through every single video that I had made just to answer the question, whereas, you know, of course, you guys can go and watch the same video as me. But then, after some back and forth, I decided, you know what, I'm going to make a video where we're going to find out which one of these pencil sharpeners, and I have a whole lot of them here, created this point. Now one thing that dawned on me through the conversation was that it had to have been an electric. So I'm going to start with the electric first, and, and I may end with the electric. We'll see as this video progresses. And I've got my supply of 9XXBs here. And this is all I have left is what's in this box, which looks like I got uh, just six more in here. So this is my precious supply. And as you can see, uh, one's already pre-sharpened with a long point. Not as long, but it's pretty pointy. And the other ones have little standard narrow points. So these are going to be my guinea pigs. And... Uh, I guess after making this video, I might have to buy my, myself some, some more 9XXBs since I'm going to be using my supply as a, as a test. Okay, so first off, let's take a look at this AFMAT sharpener here that I did a video on. Um, I don't recall what the part number is on this, so you can just remember what it looks like and find the video on that or okay now I just tagged down the video on this one right here and it looks like the video is called AFMAT electric long point pencil sharpener so let's see what kind of uh, point we can get with this now why we're going to use this one is you notice it has a size for small and big so the only sharpeners I'm obviously going to be testing here are the ones that accept the bigger, or I should say the wider shaft pencils like the 9XXB. Hopefully I still have enough charge on this thing because uh, I haven't used it in a while. But let's see what kind of point we get out of this. And you can see this has the short point here. So. Okay, it is an auto stop, so remember that this one here is an auto stop. I don't know which is the name, but take a look at that point. We can pretty much stop right here because that is about the longest point I think I've ever seen. Okay, that's a long point. But let me just go ahead and write it up here that this is the AFMAT long point. Okay. okay, it looks like it's called the, the PS09. Alright, so that's the first one here. Alright, so let me now go and 
bring another sharpener up here and see what it does. Okay, now the other sharpener that I have is the West the Westcott, uh, it's a heavy duty. Um, I think it's called the iSchool. Uh, I'm not sure, I'll look it up here in a second. But it is plugged in behind my drawing desk and it would be difficult for me to move my furniture to get to it. So I went over there and I took this pencil and I set it to the biggest hole that it would accept. And uh, this is the point it gave. It's a decent point, I like it. It's not as long as that one, but it's pretty decent. So we're going to write down here, this is the Westcott. Whoops, I broke my tip. That's what happens with these long points. This is the Westcott. And let me get the rest of the details here. I point school heavy duty. And I broke the tip, so I got to go sharpen it again. Okay, so that's our second one here. It's, it's not as long, but it's a pretty decent point. I mean, you really don't need it any longer than that. So far, the longest one was that aft mat. All right, now I need to go find another pencil sharpener that will accept these uh, wider shaft type pencils. And okay, as far as the electric pencil sharpeners are concerned, uh, there was one more. But if you watch that video, you'll remember that I actually had to take a drill and put a hole in it just so that it would take the bigger pencils. And you really can't buy them with the big hole. So I'm not even going to bother testing that one because now that I have, of course, these two right here, why, there's no need for me to be butchering uh, any more pencil sharpeners. But I dug this one up and... Um, the reason I pulled it out is because it has a wide enough hole in here that it will accept these bigger pencils. It's not an electric, but hey, I said I would go and use others if, if I had the time. And so since I'm all out of the electrics, let's see what this uh, hand crank one will do. Okay, well that's all it's going to do. And as you can see, that's a pretty decent point too. Um, it's about equal with the Westcott, but everything pales in significance to the AFMAT long point PS09. So I'm going to just put here, this is the, the Del I or Del E. Uh, it says number 0668 right there. I don't know if that's actually a part number or not, but and on the side it says Sweet Memories, so I'll write that in there too, Sweet Memories. So this is another option for uh, sharpening your 9XXBs to a, a nice point. Let me see if I can find something else that can accept uh, the wider pencils. Okay, um, now I found this one on the shelf. I tell you, it's not a bad problem to have where you have to dig through a bunch of pencil sharpeners just to try to find ones that will, will do a certain thing. But I notice it has a selection here. I don't remember um, how this turned out, but let's take a look. It's another, it's another Westcott type. It's a hand cranker. So let's see, um, grab one of these and Find which one will accept. Okay, it's already set to a big hole there. So, let's see what this one will do. Now this one here, of course, requires it to be um, held down onto the with a clamp or something. As one of these things, you clamp it down. But let me see if I can try to sharpen this by do a couple of double jointed things here. I'm going to try to force it in like this. Probably sound like I'm about ready to snap this thing off. Okay. 
that that's the point it gives. It's kind of a basic point, so um, I wouldn't call it a long point, and I wouldn't even bother with it. I mean, it works, but it's it's not a long point for a 9XXB. So we'll just go ahead and put that away. Okay, so it looks like I'm not going to have to, after all, go through my supply of 9XXBs. And boy, am I happy about that, because I didn't really want to have to reorder these too soon. I was hoping these would last me until the next millennium. Well, maybe not that long. However, with that said, uh, I've gone through the pencil sharpeners that I have, and to answer that question that I was asked by a viewer, as far as a long point sharpener is concerned, I would first opt for this AFMAT PS09, okay, and uh, you, can, you can definitely check the uh, description area, I'll have the link to the video, you can go watch that video, and uh, it'll talk more about this particular pencil sharpener. And on top of that, we have the Westcott Eye Point School Heavy Duty, which gives, I think, the second best long point. There's your two long points. Obviously, one is pretty nasty. The other one is just a pretty decent long point. We'll do the job. But there you go. There are your choices that I can offer you. And of course, if you want a hand cranker, well then there's that deli, um, the Sweet Memory 0668. So I'll have the link to that video as well. So all three videos, the links will be down in the description below. Well, I hope that answers any of your questions about sharpening the 9XXB with a really long point. I hope you liked the video. If so, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Click the notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.